helping female athletes and, and groundbreaking every single day and pushing the glass ceiling, I think only is going to make everything better in the future for the younger girls and boys. And I think, you know, just also being on the U.S. national team and, and being able to be a part of a, a massive change and a shift in, in female empowerment is something that I've been really proud to continue to push. A lot of the times, especially with younger girls, you see them drop out of sport. And I feel like it's important for us um, as female athletes to, you know, push them in any way we can. I think anyone, anything you set your mind to, you can, you know, you can reach and they just need to be told that and encouraged and shown that. The times I saw my friends and my teammates or their parents or anyone involved putting pressure on them, it became more about fear and scared and, and doubt. When I was younger, I feel like what kept me in sport and motivated every single day to get better was to focus on having fun. Did we meet at a youth national team camp first? Yeah, we did, 15. You, fif you yeah, 17? You, you 17, yeah. Yeah. But we were still 16, like we weren't 17. Yeah. yeah. We both knew we were going to University of Virginia and we kind of talked about it a little bit, but when we actually became friends was freshman year, I feel like um, Morgan and I had a lot of classes together. Um, so we kind of helped each other through each of the classes because college was a big transition. I didn't really know I wanted to play professional soccer until probably junior or senior year where my um, coach at Virginia inspired me to like enter the draft and so I did and fortunately I ended up in Chicago. Entered the draft and I actually got drafted to the Houston Dash uh, where I spent three years um, of my, my professional career there and then of course Danny and I couldn't be separated anymore so I asked her and how Chicago was and she loved it and so I wanted to play with some great players and, and be in a great city and so I wanted to make the move and come to Chicago and so I did. Sometimes when you're in these professional environments you don't have your family around you don't have necessarily support outside of soccer so having such a good friend on the team helps in a lot of different ways on the field off the field. I think it's been a huge blessing to have Danny and our friendship has just only grown since college and then I think at this point in time we've been friends now for 10 plus years and and I think you know for us we're gonna be friends forever and it doesn't really matter with soccer or not. <laughs>